So I'm going to show you how to add a picture and edit the text to customize your thank you notes. You'll see that you've got two options here, either Christmas or birthday. I'm going to show you on the Christmas version. So to insert a picture, you come up to the top to the insert tab and hit pictures. We're going to put this picture, this little boy in. You see that it's way too big at this time. So if you double click on it, you'll see there's white circles on each corner. You can click on one and drag it to adjust it to the size you want. It's still a little bit too tall so if you double click on it and come over to crop you can cut it down just a little bit. Put it where I want. Another really fun thing you can do is hit this down arrow on crop and crop it to a bunch of different shapes. So I could make it be a circle. I'm actually going to make it be a rectangle right here with soft corners. There's also a lot of other fun things that you can do as long as you're under the picture tools format tab. You can change coloring, make it a little bit brighter if you want. You can make it be different colors, black and white, sapia. Right here you'll see there's a bunch of different frames if you wanted to put a frame on it. I'm not going to at this time. Um, picture effects is also a really fun thing too. You can add shadows. You can add soft edges which is another one of my favorite features to kind of make that hard edge soft. Um, a reflection is another fun thing. So there's just a bunch of different things that you can do to make your picture the way you'd like it. The next thing we're going to do is if you just want to double click on the text you can change your font over here if you want to. But I'm going to keep it at this and you can type in whatever either you or your child wants to say to the person who gave them the gift. So dear Grandma, oops, thank you for the teddy bear. And if you hit delete, it'll bring those different lines up a little bit closer. I love it because it's so soft. And then you can either have your child put a handprint or sign their name or just type it in like that. And then you've got a customized thank you card. I'm going to space this, make it look a little bit better. And then when you're ready, you just go to File and Print. And make sure you've got the right slide selected. Um, I like to print mine on photo paper, but you can do it on whatever you want. And then you've got a fun customized thank you card to give to the gift givers. So if you have any questions, if I haven't answered anything, you can contact me at my website at timesavers.etsy.com. Thanks.